twisted, maybe we are pushing too hard. What do you mean? It's not tired. I remember. Hmm. Okay, what else? Anyway, um, because I keep forgetting, I'm doing a giveaway at 50 subscribers because I'm, you know, I always, um, maybe I should do a video later. So, um, all you have to do is be a visible subscriber and you're in the running to get a Steam key for the Suicide Guy. Um, full disclosure, is because I know the dev. Um, yeah, this is running a lot better than last time. Wait. Um, very hungry, was he, uh, very hungry? I might give a, another, another day without food. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds a bit cruel, but fuck him. Uh, loves what he's doing, but uh, he's rather chilly. Yeah, it's gonna start getting cold soon. I can tell from that weather. But I'm just gonna leave it how it is. God, what's up with this woman and never running? Come on, run! There you go. So you have to click fucking four times to get him moving. You should just be like single click, walk, double click, run. But oh no, wait, have I got it to show cursor? Shit, I can't I can't check until afterwards. I'll just assume it's on show cursor. Maybe I'll check during a loading screen real quick. We got news. Alright. Wait till it's over, then I'll check that. Um, doubt anyone's gonna come by, but I'll just keep it over here. It's almost like there's a microwave or a TV down, down here by the door. Even though I've still got cursor visible. I did have to change the windows. Like, from last time. Should've had it from the beginning. At least it's gonna be a better video than the last one. But I don't know, it might be a long one too. It might be like an hour long fucking government propaganda. But is anyone threatening to kill us? Because last time they were, maybe there's I mean no one's came yeah. Maybe nothing happens to I progress the story because it's one of those I don't want to say linear, because it does kind of have changing story for this, but semi-linear, I'll say, yeah. I wonder how long it would take for someone to get depression, though. It'll probably happen, like, after the next quest point, not the one that I'm on currently, where I gotta find the truck or whatever. Alright, now that's... Oh shit, someone is here. Alright. Esma, have you seen my glasses? Okay. I, I thought they always just have it on them, like as a... It's a video game, we we don't have them fall off even if we're hanging upside down. Kind of thing. Uh, video games and glasses. Oh wow, is this, thank you for warning, okay, no, it's just the one that got marked as new up here. Wait, I've got something to broadcast, actually, okay. Um, it appears that the clashes between the military and the separatists, separatists, what is this, that, that, that makes me think of fucking Star Wars, like, the, um, the fucking prequels are going to intensify in the upcoming days. Rebel and government forces are engaged in violent skirmishes throughout the city same some areas have been completely out cut off while others are seeing heavy fighting okay okay i wonder if there's a progress but oh shit <laughs> he just does it like immediately just like that's all the thing <laughs> There's not like a little bar for, oh, fucking, you're not gonna get cigarettes, buddy, like, this is not gonna happen. Okay. 
I could check, but I, yeah, I definitely need that one. <laughs> oh, special camera. Thank you, I heard, heard you're wanting about the sniper in the foot. Oh, okay, yeah, here we go. Here's the thing that I talked about in like the first part, I think it was, where it, everything that you do good generally comes back and it's generally by someone that comes here to talk to you. Do I have to click? I thought this was automatic. Yeah, do I? Yeah, I, I have to click. It used to be my daily route, you probably said. <laughs> oh, okay, here we go. Oh, we, we saved someone's life. No, I didn't mean walk outside, you fucking idiot. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no crafting, it's just four gears. I think I need four to upgrade the bench. But until I get anything out, you can even trade for. Oh, I think maybe you still got it from when I traded him. I mean, I still need meat to be able to craft more if I upgrade the bench another two. I don't think that's gonna fucking happen. Though. This is. This DLC has been fucking brutal on me. Um, alcohol is really hard to trade for, so I don't even think I'll be able to do that. Benches might be useful, though, if, if my chick gets fucked up in a fight, which I'll probably have to do. I'm, I'm just going to have to bet on me getting good loot when I, when I get past the guy tomorrow. God. I don't know if I should kill him or just run past him. I'm thinking I'll just run past him, but... Mm. I don't know. I misplaced my glasses again. Yep. Hang on, does he, does he have it on his model? Let's see. Oh, that's fully zoomed in. I can't. Yeah, it looks like it's on him. Yeah, it looks like he's got his glasses on him. A bit hard to tell, but... So I was thinking it, they'd probably not have a distinct, like, different model for the um, glasses that just comes on and off his actual character model, depending on whether he had it on or off, but I didn't think they'd bother with it, because you generally so zoomed out that you wouldn't even see something like that anyway. I hope the power doesn't go out. <laughs> You're using fire, what the power? Come on, dog. Okay, um... Yeah. Uh, no, I need to go to gas station. It's the only place that has anything. Yeah. It actually tells me here that my, like... You have to do it for the story, essentially. <laughs> Zero percent, though. Why are they... What? What else? Huge amount of weapons they stay, stay still. Um, Alright, take it slow. You never know where he is. He could be in his first room. I don't know if it's always cycled to the same spot so that it'd be uh I mean, if he's in here or he's climbing up the stairs, then it is. Because that would have been twice now in separate days. But let's see. I've opened this door now, so I don't even really need to bother with that. I'll zoom out a bit, because I'm fully zoomed in here. That, I know, is a road. Oh, shit. Alright, he can't see me just looking in. He has to actually open the door. And from what I've seen, I haven't actually seen him open this door yet before. So, I'm just going to hope that he's only going to get here and go keep going. Is not actually just gonna open the door, and then I'll just sneak down. I do everything in here because I don't, I don't think I managed to get around to that. I can't remember if he chased me off or what, but I remember that I didn't end up searching this little bottom area. So at least I, I'll do that before I worry about. Oh, shit, I gotta remember. Where's it? Where's the door? You fucking. God, I've still got to search all that crap, too. I know what they say. I, I can't remember what they say, but... I wish it'd be nice to double-check just because I've gotten... Just full-on zoom out. That's a max zoom. Just so I can fucking... 
see him a bit better because this is a big fucking place. This gas station. Alright, I'll leave that for a bit later. And if he comes after me, I can just run straight away. I'm safe for a while. It's more like when I'm getting past that shipping container, like the two shipping containers, that really worries me because I'm kind of... Let's see. I don't know if that car's gonna stop me. It looks like it's it's on the like it leads to the front, so that's a dead end. And I feel like it is. Like if this is a gas station that they originally had in, which I think it is, then there's only ever been one way to get into it. No information gained, okay. So alright. God that music always stresses me out, like the build up there. Fucking So grim. It's just over there, is it? Oh. Boy. Let me check that too. Sim supply crates bearing military marks. They look like they were bought here recently. I hope I don't have to cut out too much, like we go. Drag marks quite deep. Yeah, yeah, I remember that one. <sighs> yeah, fuck it. Balls in. Shit, all in, all in, balls out. Maybe this. So that's probably a search spot too. It looks like he can go past if he's searching it. This might be it. Alright, he's done. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, if he's still searching, then I'll search that and then go here. Uh, come on. This is always so stressful, this sort of shit. Like in most stealth games, there's a lot more leniency on, like, on where I who's he referring to does he know that someone's here I've got news for Malik yep all right so I've just got to search this and that's where the weapons are at this truck all right and it looks like he... no there's no more okay so I have to go to the left that means when I go in I've still got to work on getting my way out I can't just run off to the right and get home. Alright. Keep it fully zoomed again. He shouldn't notice me. Because generally they don't ever do. I'm going to wait till it's further away before I... At least there's a spot just by the van to hide in, but it's still fucking... Thank god there's only one of him, to be fair. Like, I did have to do in the last one, just near the end, you had to, like, kill a fucking room full of them. Like, there were three or something that you could kill. That you had to kill, sorry. And then there was, like, another two that you could just walk past that I found, and it was just super painful to do it. One of them you could easily get the drop on, but the others it was quite hard. Two of them were like in the same. A damaged army truck, it must have hit something. It's full of crates, judging by the markings. They contain military food, rations, and medical. Well, um, what did I have before? Yep. I had rations, not really military food, but it's only had medical supplies. Alright, let's go over to this one, because it. Going for it, keep going for it. Here's a truck, there's plenty of supplies on it. Enough to help many starving and sick. I disagree. 
unless you only picked up some of it and the rest is just there in like lore terms because that is a lot of fucking craze to be fair shit i'm stuck here yep i am to to fucking leave buddy do you fuck off i'm here bloody radio i don't want to move until he's fucking Yeah, because I, I, like, when he was standing there, I knew that at some point he'd turn around and rather be in my safe spot. anything is he when he well he may not even search the thing he's looking at it oh shit he is searching it wait no he's not he's just looking all right we've got a bit more time <laughs> fucking i always forget like that his 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 ranger sight isn't it that great because every time i've played this it's always like they just instantly been able to see me regardless of um how far they are so i always figured that the range was infinite because like most of the places to be fair it doesn't stretch on this fucking bar you no know, without like a wall or a door or something which would cut off their line of sight anyway let's see all right let's let's just fucking this ditch. Maybe this? Question mark. Didn't have to kill him. This neither. Useless junk. Okay, he's still searching. Now this is fucking run for me. And I'm back safe. Yay. Next part of the game. Esme's reflections. This truck is full of supplies and we we all desperately need it. If Malik broadcasts its location, it'll help many people survive. Yeah, but some will die on the way to get into him because I mean sure there's only one guy, so enough people that are hungry could overtake him, but like plenty will die trying to get to him because it's got a full automatic assault rifle. Like fast message well yeah, of course. Doesn't even have an option to not. Uh, uh. I mean, it makes sense that he just, the guy instantly kills himself when he fucking fails because, like, gameplay wise, what else can he really do on his own? I mean, he's stuck on the fucking one floor. So you can't even access the crafting table. I've got good news from the gas station. Hmm. Kinda. Can I skip it? There we go. I found out that there's a broken down army truck full of supplies, uh, relay to Mark, uh, found interesting stuff, yep. Alright, now you guys can eat. Oh, fuck me, it's come sick. I can't, I can't craft, do they have a heater? No, it's a distillery. Water purifier, whatever. Um... Maybe, maybe they got a, in here? A novel, fucking, a herbal garden. I'm not even probably going to use that, but. Nothing in there. Yeah, no, I don't. No, no heaters, so I'd have to craft that. And I'd have to get the wood. I haven't even found any fucking books. 
from all the few fucking piles of rubbish there hadn't been fucking anything from her what the hell mods you're supposed to help me fucking I guess she should come up here just so she can give him the thing after he reports story relayed and why is it am I just meant to have the option to re-relay it why is it like I'm popping this up. Um, recent news. The basement of the gas station on Maple Street holds plenty of fuel for the stoves. Huh. An army truck for military rations. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, as in relayed from her. I, I haven't actually posted it. That one seems more important to say rather than the basement. So we'll say the basement afterwards, I think. Get your share before the military reclaims it. Yeah. I don't know if that will lead to death, so... Oh shit, she's got to talk to him about something. I don't know I hope people will manage to take the supplies from the truck before the army gets there and no one will get... Oh shit, is it going to do one of those things where it's like... Even though you try to do something good, it will ultimately lead to tons of people. Because I feel like this is going to end out really disastrous now they're talking about before the army gets there. So I feel like a ton of people will show up together and then the military will at the same time. Right, I hope our broadcast about the supply truck helps some people. They're all in this. We're all in this together. <laughs> uh. Let's say people are done with this truck before the soldiers arrive. Yeah, yeah, you fucking... You'd hope so. I'm sure someone might. Franco the trader paid us a visit, thank you. I have to thank you. Do I have to... This seems like a story. Yeah, because the camera... It's not reacting to a click, so yeah, there we go, it's just automated. He used to go through the park every night. Your broadcast probably saved his life. I guess I must have missed it yesterday because I should have gotten this today. But she just said, "Just paid a visit." Broadcast probably saved his life. Yeah, come on. Very grateful, yep. Now what's he gonna say? You see, we're protecting people. It's worth it no matter what. No matter what. Hmm. Is he gonna stop endangering Esmeralda for, for like information and stories because I feel like that that's kind of from the way he's phrasing that because he's not exactly seeming like the best um, relationship they got going on we help save lives by letting people know about those supplies you can't say that for certain you don't know you literally just said it like that could kill people rather than save them. Like, we, we don't know yet. Calm down, buddy. Just... Right, yeah. About the gas station basement. Posted. I'm sure something will pop up. Yeah, because they talked about silence. So that's probably one of the things that it's like... You got the power of silence, so... I don't actually... Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, I, I need to fucking give him those meds, don't I? How's he going? Is he starving? Very hungry, alright. I'll, I'll leave him for, for one more day. And I'll probably be fucking starving. <laughs> I don't think he's eaten this whole fucking LP and it's been like six days. <laughs> Jesus fucking... Uh, did I feed him? No, I, I, I didn't. Did I? He's fucked. I can't believe they're saying this guy's Malik's overworked here though. It's like, in comparison, not really. 
nothing of interest yet. You haven't even sat down, buddy. <laughs> you haven't even got the thing on your ear, so of course there's nothing of interest yet. Fuck it. Okay, I'll click on her. In case anyone shows up again while he's doing this. I wonder if we can develop depression. Like, is that, I mean, most characters in this game generally can, because there's quite a big um, mechanic in the game. But, where's if he can? I'm really worried about getting that with the material, so, because it's gonna start getting cold, I don't know how I'm going to handle that in the LP, and oh, if I don't craft it though, I might just be stuck so hard in the LP that even with the respawns that oh, like we're about to last that uh, day, I, I might just be straight up fucked, if, if it's too cold, and this is the only way of actually heating the place up. So I didn't even get a single, like, wooden fucking 3 by 4 That's some bullshit. Everything in this game is kind of meant to be like that, honestly. Even the good deeds can be seen as bad deeds. Tough times to live in. More government propaganda. I'm rooting for you people with this truck out like it's Christmas. Okay, so we must have heard something relating to that. My name is Marauder. Because he doesn't show me like click on that unless he's got something to say that doesn't there's no way to tell him. But it looks like he's got something relating to the people now having found the truck already. I fucking put birds to it. Basement of gas. Uh, no, that's just my broadcast. All right. Yes, you have rested. I saved them bundle. The fool. Fed up with his world. Don't worry about that. 